Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com, and in this video I'm going to show you three different ways to access Facebook from your Windows mobile device. So the first method is what I call the light method, so that means it doesn't use that much data if you're over a you know, pay-as-you-go data connection or you're using a slow edge connection or something like that. And it also doesn't have as many images as the other ones that I'm going to show you. So we're going to go to Pocket Internet, Ex Internet Explorer here and go to m.facebook.com. Okay, and here we are, and what you get is the, the, the feed, the news feed that shows you what your friends are doing right now. You get some pictures. You can go over to um, friends up here and look through all of your friends. You can go into their profiles. You can write things on their wall. It's a very basic experience. Um, it's not a very rich experience like you would find on desktop Facebook or through a Facebook application. Okay, now for the second method, we're going to need Opera Mobile 9.5 because that is Ajax support. We're actually going to be using the iPhone's Facebook website to do this. So here we are and I'm going to go to iPhone.Facebook.com and here it is already. Now you're going to see it come up and it's going to look kind of strange but here's a little trick um, and this applies to the Touch Pro or Touch Diamond or Touch HD. Double tap on the page to zoom out to have it perfectly formatted to the screen and now it's basically like using Facebook on an iPhone so everything's formatted just right. If you tap on certain tabs it loads super fast because it's Ajax based. Um, if you want to look at somebody's profile you just go to um, you know you just tap on their name it goes over and we will get their profile we can write on their wall over here and it loads very fast and then we can go to photos also and browse through photos as if it were a standalone um, Facebook application not quite as good but but pretty good actually so that is Facebook using the iPhone version on uh, in Opera Mobile 9.5 and the final way to access Facebook with Windows Mobile is through the Xperia X1 panel and obviously this only works if you have an Xperia X1 so I'm going to hit the panel button down here and it's going to zoom out and show me the panels and I'm going to go to the Facebook application now we've shown this to you before but uh, the Facebook application or the panel I should say has been updated to better work with the Xperia X1 so it's a lot faster now so right now it is downloading the status of a lot of my friends I can log in like, like so And this is really interesting. So I appear in the center there, and soon I will see all of my friends fly in who have recently updated their status. And you can have this update automatically, or you can manually update it if you're trying to save on data connection. And it's happening a little slow right now, but um, once things are loaded, things are much faster. And in a second, they're all just going to fly in. And here they come. So what I can do from here is I can tap on any one of these circles that represent a friend and I can read their status up here. And I can just tap along and I see different people's status. If I click on the center, it's asking what am I doing right now? But that's not just the application. What we can do is we can click over to the actual main application and the home tab will show us our news feed. And it's very flick scroll friendly, very finger friendly. It's just like the iPhone application, but I think it's actually better. Uh, we can go over to the friends tab and it loads the friends. Okay, and here we are. All the friends are loaded and you can flick through them very easily, see them alphabetically like a Rolodex. And I'm going to tap on somebody's profile and cover it up for security. And I'm going to show you how it looks when you view photos of this person. So you can poke them, you can call them right from your phone. And here's the photos tab coming up now. And you get all the albums, so I'm going to go to this one. And they're coming up now, so I'm just going to tap on one picture, and it's going to bring it up um, to a larger screen. And we can tap to the right and to the left to get a bigger picture, and we can flip it to landscape, of course, to see the picture in its full landscape glory, and tap over like so. So that is the Facebook application, or the Facebook panel, on the Xperia X1. So there it is, three different ways to get to Facebook on Windows Mobile. You have the light version via Pocket Internet Explorer, the more featured version via Opera Mobile 9.5, and of course the Xperia X1 panel that you can only get right now in the Xperia X1. Uh, there are a lot of other Facebook applications that are in the works out there. Some of them aren't really ready for prime time, but as soon as there's something good out there, we'll post another video about it so that you can stay connected by using um, Facebook on your Windows Mobile device. That's it for now.